We are nomads, living in patchwork yurts and shanty shacks. No bricks divide us. Our boundaries are fluid as air, and though our future is fraught, we take up the mantle of the artists and dreamers who return to the old ways. We are miners, panning through the residue of power. We are scavengers digging for truth in the lies. We shall not escape hell, my passionate sisters, dancing around the fires of change, but what riches we find in the ruins. We call out to you from the future. We are the phantoms who dance through your dreams. Wake up! Wake up! Your house is on fire. You still have a choice. Come back. Shut your screens. Act now or come dance with us in the embers of the Anthropocene. Time moves slow when you count it. And we're breathing each breath. We're scared, but we're alive. We're scarred, but we're vibrant. We're hungry, but we're free. When we're frightened, we look to the sky. No moon. Just drones and false stars. But we see beyond, trees and hills and undulating skies, flowers, bees, the nectar of the sun. Our mother painted these on her inner eye. At night, we're in a trance. We sweat and we cry out. We don't want to dance, we want to go home. They said you will die of starvation. They said you will die of the poisoned air. They said you will die by the knife or the gun. They said you will die of disease. We said we would rather die of that roar which lies on the other side of the silence. We said we would rather hear the grass grow and the beating of the shaman's drum. They said you can't revive a hollow tree. But we knew the seeds were buried deep. Spells for the summoning in our bones, stories from the heart beating in our veins. At night we round our fires, we encant the words they tried to make us forget. Acorn, adder, crocus and catkin, heron, herring, mussel and newt, magpie, minnow, moss and leopard, otter, oyster, lobster and wren. Earth and heart, heart and earth. We seek the stolen language to describe the force that makes the acorn grow into the oak. Our fingers flicker, our blood is on fire, the blue-eyed hag is released from the cloven pine. We know that shoots will sprout from the ashes, we know that a flame is a light in the dark. In the chill nucleus of night we ride out, with Baba Yaga in her chicken-legged house. Tattered demelians, hag-worn players of pipes, we scour the sky with our brooms. The legends tell how Baba lent her fire to a girl named Greta with golden hair. A great leader we honor as we dance. Hope is the feeling that keeps you going. Even though all odds may be against you, hope comes from action, not just words. Hope is telling it like it is. Your leaders speak in riddles, setting up targets with loopholes and lies, saying one thing and doing another. Three decades of blah, blah, blah. If you don't know the swallows are coming, you won't know to welcome them in spring and be there to celebrate the great awakening. If you don't feel the rhythms and patterns within, you won't know that what you crave is not things, but belonging. Remember that once you were bird woman. Remember that once you were free. Remember that once you danced with the same force that makes the seed unfurl in the depths of the dark earth. Remember that once you were connected to the web of all things. Earth and heart, heart and earth. Come now, sisters, let Baba relight the fire in your soul. Dance with the constellations in your hair. Let it be said 100 million years hence, when we are but a seam of strange strata in the life of this great and ancient earth, that we did not forget our kinship with the animals, the plant people, the tree folk, the dwellers in the depths and the heights. Let it be said that we were a species whose legacy was love.